Hi, what's up here, Dolphin Kicks? Today we're here for a new episode of Central Shopping, right here at the Central Montreal location. Today we have a guest that's been supporting Central since day one. He's a rapper, DJ, producer. Welcome to my boy, Lou Phelps. Uh, yo, hop out the coupe with a bad bitty, got these other niggas like word. Uh, brand new rolly, two tone, two phones, got these hitters like word. And I spin a grip on a piece and I bless the beat, spinning like a priest, that's word. I already know. To this, he's gonna check out the shop, have his opinion on some kicks, see what he's been through with sneakers and stuff like that, and let's get into it. Props, because that's not something every day you see in Montreal. Yeah, the Air Maxes. <laughs> let, let, let's bring down the heat. It's a bit too hot right now. Yeah, All right, so first, what got you started into sneakers? So, the first time I got into sneakers, um, I used to like I used to buy these old magazines like the Vibe magazines, XXL, all that. And then I remember seeing um, a Jordan like they, they spoke about all the Jordans that Jordan used to play with. And I remember seeing a picture of Jordan dunking with the the ones on, or was it the threes? I think it was the threes. But I remember like framing that picture and like you know just focusing on that. And then there was a, another page with all the shoes like each number of the Jordans and like how they look like and all that and I was like ah oh, man I need I need these and I was like probably like 12 or 13 years old at that time and I never had money to buy shoes and then that's what got me into sneakers like seeing Kanye West rocking the ones seeing Pharrell the BBC's and all that you know that's what got me into sneakers and would you say because of that maybe what's your favorite pair of sneakers like in terms of model are they the ones uh, the ones classic easy to wear matches with everything like you could wear with a suit you could wear with baggy ass pants you could wear with fit pants whatever you want to wear with that. but my favorite colorway is definitely the chicago's for sure okay all right so you said like your favorite model or jordan ones here we got a few what would you say would be your top three being like the chicago's in first what yeah. would be like second spot and third spot i would go chicago first for sure then I would go the the easy way, of course, the Royals and um, Breads for sure. Like I gotta stay simple and clean, you know. Stick to the OGs. Yeah. And what do you feel about the newest colorway? You know, the ones that are not exactly like retros because it's the first time they've done it. Like they do a lot of like those pattern letters lately. Here they cut it. Honestly, you I'm like, Chicago. I'm not a huge fan of these. I like I like these for sure. I fuck with these. I fuck with these too. Okay. I like the I like the different colors like the. How do you say, like, push forward the envelope of, you know, the way people dress and, like, you don't go for the usual black and white or black, white, red, you know, just put a little splash of pink, a splash of uh, teal and shit like that. That's what I like. Okay, yeah. cool. And uh, there's a lot of Jordan ones that just released this year, last year, for you, the, you, the top one Jordan one that released, like, the, from the latest. Year, the latest. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, I would say the Union LA. The Union uh, LA joints. That's like the LA exclusives that yeah. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> he sold me these like a, a while back, but these were, yeah, these are pretty sick. Also, you sold me these too, the Nigel Sylvester. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. These are like my two favorites right now, two favorite ones that came out like last year or this year. It's, yeah. yeah. Totals you like like more the underground like like drop sometime. Lately this one that's been very popular compared to uh Travis or Off White. What do you think about this collab? Nah man, this collab is like pretty sick. I like the I like the concept of it. I like I really wanted these. I didn't get them for some reason, but I really wanted these. But um yeah man. I like the concept. I like the fact that they that they try to push the envelope again, you know, just trying to make something out of the box and make something really like different that's what i like most about about these shoes you know the, the model is crazy the colors that they use is crazy also like the white um yellow red and um navy is like insane yeah, but one big question like you, we know like sometimes you travel you have some tours outside yeah what do you usually pack in your like backpack like, in terms of sneakers in terms of sneakers i always bring two pairs like i wear one pair so that i could be comfy and then i wear i, I bring like two more pairs if it's a long trip but if it's a short trip i just bring two pairs and i'm good but um i gotta get a pair of ones in there for sure like jordan ones and then Something classic, probably like an Air Max or something like that, you know, just something really simple. So, uh, you know, it matches with everything. You know, some simple shit like breads or fucking these, some shit like that. Or Royal. 
Yeah. She can't go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like simple, simple stuff. Okay. Hype but simple. You know. Okay, cool. Like you gotta look good on the road. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So you gotta get the the nice stuff going for sure. But at the same time, it has to match with everything that you wear. So. And in terms of clothing, we we know like you you wear a lot of local brands. We know also you wear Supreme, you wear Babe. What what what's your inspirations in terms of clothing too? Uh, clothing. I'm trying to I'm trying to not look like everybody, but at the same time, I'm trying to be very relaxed. Like this is a very simple hoodie that I'm wearing, like awake, but yet it's like a, a hype brand. Very simple, just a black hoodie, black black uh, kotori shirt. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I gotta wear a little a little Jap. I love Japanese Japanese brands. You know, a little uh, non-native, non-native pants, and uh, Japanese collab uh, Air Maxes. You know, so just you know, just like a mixture of like Japanese swag and a little, you know, a little American Montreal or so. You know, that's what I like to do. Okay, so, cool. All right, so now is the cup or drop. We're gonna have his opinion on some of the most hypest drop that just released, and also some of the most hated drops that just released. We're gonna see what he likes and what he doesn't, and also why. So the answer is gonna be either cup or drop. So let's start with the first colorway. You have a pair of Vapor Max that released not too long ago, very limited quantities. They're only released in women's sizes, so it was really hard for any man to get their sizes on. Damn, I didn't know that. <laughs> what do you think about the new cactus plant vapor maxes? Well, to me, it's like an automatic cup. I really wanted these and I hollered at my Nike plug for the longest time and he was like, nah, you can't get them. Like, I wish I had more, but these are like a must have, in my opinion. For sure, I'm copying this, for sure. Okay. Let's go to the next one. This has been one of the most hype released lately. The thing is, a lot of people are saying, oh, they only hype because a certain artist did them and because usually Jordan 6s are not that popular. Personally, I love the model. I'm still looking for my pair, but it's not everybody that likes them, even Travis Scott fans. We have, of course, the Air Jordan 6s and Travis Scott's. To me, it's an Insta cop also, because I'm a big Jordan 6 fan. Um, I remember waiting in line for like the slam dunks, slam dunk sixes, and like, you know, I had to get them. It's just like the, the shape of the shoe, it fits well on, on like you, you put them on and then the jeans fall so so good on them, you know. I just love them. I just love them and like this is like insane. The little, the little you know, pocket right here. You can put your change in it. A little change, a little something else too. <laughs> The, the cactus jack in the back is sick, you know. It's a dope shoe, man. I don't know who who's hating on that, but it's a really dope shoe, in my opinion. Yeah. Insta Cup. Insta Cup. All right, and nonetheless, the last pair, been kind of under the radar, but pretty popular. It's going for quite a good amount, for especially for what this model is. They kind of changed the definition of what a Nurmax is because they're very different. The color is very vibrant. We have the Ermac 97s. This is sick. This is something I would wear for sure. Like, I would definitely rock. I like the fact that there's like three um, tongues. Oh, well, not tongues, tongue pullers or whatever. I like this also in the back. I like, oh, I like all of this. this. This shoe is like, it looks, it looks sick. I would definitely wear this. I like the color, I like all every time. All right. For the first time in history in Central Shopping, we have a triple cop. For sure. So, no drops for this one. For sure. So now's the time. Let him see the shop, what we have, he likes, maybe cop some kicks, cop some clothing. You have the best chance of seeing what you want. Let's go. the insta cop i had to get these so i'm saying i'm getting these all right so you got the cactus blend vapor maxes one of the sickest pair we have in the shop right now you looked around and then you seen them these at, at first and that's how it goes so we're gonna get these get the orange bag because if you leave central without the orange bag you just play yourself so it's gonna be 17 24 and 60 Three Respect, bro. Nice. Once again, it. see you soon. So, hi. So what's up here? What's Dolphin Kings? Of course, Luke Phelps was here too. You check out the store. Came out with some heat. Yeah. And bro, respect once again for coming by. 
Thank you for watching everyone. Be sure to check out his music. We're gonna drop some links down below. And also don't forget to comment down with Shitty. You wanna see the, the next pop-up in. Because we went to Granby, we went to Sherbrooke, we went to Quebec. But we deserve to see these around Montreal too. So let us know and see you till next time. Can't forget the fact about the new name. I'm your pharmacist, baby. Get this vitamin. Damn. Hey, baby, is you down the ride? Knocking at your front door, let me come inside. Knocking at your front door, let me come inside. Can you let a brother know if you're down the ride? Uh, hey, baby, is you down the ride?